Today, I'm meeting with Lindsay Schwartz at Schwartz Brothers Bakery in Seattle to see how they make their delicious pastries, cookies, and bread. The first thing Lindsay shows me is their scaling and mixing room where all the ingredients are scaled and mixed so their products maintain a precise consistency. So what are these going to be? These are going to be Mary and Berry muffins. Okay. So there's another great uh, Washington fruit that we yeah. can use. You know, we try to automate as many things as possible because you want to have efficiency and, and you want to get the right price to the customer. But we've also built our brand on, on really being an artisan bakery yeah. uh, and having that, that hand touch feel to it. So you can see here, uh, we actually literally top every single, every muffin with a couple berries and we do that by, by hand. hand. I wanted to get my hands dirty, so Lindsay took me over to the frosting station. And just a little swipe, yeah. not much. So like how much, like that, a little bit. Oh. No, I'm not even, I'm not even handling the frosting right yet. Oh, that was bad. More. Better? Yeah, am I fired? Yeah. I'm fired, she says, yeah. <laughs> Since I was fired from my frosting job, we continue on with the tour. Okay, so this so. is where we do the fruit-filled danishes. Awesome. And uh, you can see that we're making the apple, which is Washington, uh -huh. Washington apples. We're a local bakery. Our customer base is local. And, and in the Northwest, in Washington, people like to eat local. They like to support local farms. And we're just so lucky, that, you know, where we live, we have an abundance of great, great fruit. So uh, we take advantage of it wherever we can. Next, the items are baked in the oven room and then placed in their cooling room before they're packaged and ready for delivery. It's awesome. called Schwartz Brothers because it was my dad and my uncle, and they actually started, they started in the restaurant business in 1970 and then started a really small bakery in 1973. Mm -hmm. We mostly did pies back in the 70s. Okay. And, uh, and over time, we just started to do more and more things, and it just, it just took off from there. And look at those cool cookies. Right, that's something we're really excited about. So we are now an official partner of the Seahawks, and uh, these are the official Seahawks cookie. And as far as we know, there's nobody else in the NFL that does a licensed uh, logoed cookies. And so eventually we'll see these. In time for football season, you should see them in all the grocery stores in town, drug stores, at the stadium. Yeah. Yeah, it's going to be fun. Go Hawks. Go Hawks. <laughs>